Thank you for watching this video. Please click on the like and subscribe buttons so that I can continue to make more videos like this. Let's talk a little bit more about deducts. On half inch conduit, the deduct on a 90 degree angle is 5 inches. On 3 quarter inch conduit, like what we just bent, it is 6 inches. On 1 inch conduit, the deduct for a 90 degree angle is 8 inches. And on one and a quarter inch conduit, the deduct is 11 inches. Now, the larger the conduit, the larger the deduct, and that only makes logical sense. So, we marked our pipe at 10 inches, put our arrow there, and the resulting 90 was 16 inches long. Now, if we wanted that 90 degree bend to end up being only 10 inches long, we would have to take our deduct, which is 6 inches, and we subtract that from 10 and get 4. So we mark our pipe at 4 inches, place the arrow mark on 4, make our bend, and our 90 would end up being 10 inches long. So let's do that right now. We've got another piece of pipe here. I'm going to mark it 4 inches, which is 10 inches minus 6 inches, which is our deduct on a 3 quarter inch bender. Now once again, I'm going to take my bender and I'm going to put the arrow of the bender on that mark. And now remember on our bending, our technique, we want to use steady foot pressure. Again, my left hand is just there for balance, really. It's, it's not pulling on the conduit. I can see, once again, I'm starting to get close. So I want to put my level. And I want to go just a little bit further with this bend. Okay, so we bend it a little more. And I look. I'm going to check it more closely here. Okay, now it looks like I've made this 90 a little bit too far. So I have to take some of the bend out. Now the nice thing about EMT is that it's forgiving. Now, you can place the handle of the bender over the end of the pipe. I'm just going to push out a little bit to take some of that bend out. And I take a look with my level. And now I've got it to 90 degrees. It's time to measure. See how close we are. And if you look at this, you can see that we're at 10 degree, 10 inches long. So the stub ended up being 10 inches long, which was what we wanted in the first place. So remember, we took our original measurement of 10 and we subtracted the deduct, which was 6 for a 3 quarter inch pipe. We marked our pipe at 4 inches, placed the arrow point of the bender on that mark, bent our 90 degree angle, and we ended up with a 10 inch 90. Thank you for watching this video. Please click on the like and subscribe buttons so that I can continue to make more videos like this. If you find this video helpful, please consider donating using the PayPal link below. Thank you.